Hi everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create. Today I'm gonna to share with you the mid-year release from Stamperia. There's a couple of collections and then some of their older collections, they've, got, they've done a couple of new things with them. So I'm gonna start out with Hortensia. It is new this summer. And uh, with this release, we're gonna have the 12 by 12, 10 sheet, 22 design pack. We're also gonna have the eight by eight paper collection pack. Same thing, just a smaller scale. We have the die cuts, and then I, I don't have it to show you right now, but in July, we will have the adhesive chipboard for Hortensia. If you go to our um, site, you'll see that there is a link to the chipboard and you can pre-order it and it'll ship in July. This is shipping right now. So isn't this beautiful? These colors are just stunning. I'm very excited to work on this. I love all the cut aparts. I think all these tags are just wonderful. I think it's great how they put it behind the cover which is, you know, a page that you're, you're not gonna use this side no matter what, so that's a great place to place the tags. I love the cut aparts. I like to use those in my albums as large photo features. Look how beautiful this is. I'm just loving this collection. Lovely, lovely. Okay, again, this is 10 pages with 22 individual designs, and we have it in the 12 by 12, eight by eight, the, the, um, the die cuts, and then later um, next month, late next month, we will have the chipboard. Beautiful birds. There's opportunities to do some fussy cutting of the flowers and the bird cages, butterflies. It's really beautiful. The colors are much more saturated than I thought they'd be when I looked at it in the catalog. Uh, so it's very deep um, and I think you can do a lot, a lot with it. So I'm looking forward to doing something with this album. This is a beautiful page right here. And it's easy for me to see, and here's a lot of cut aparts. It's very easy for me to see um, how to use this in a 12 by 12 traditional layout or in a mini album. Um, the pattern scales seem to suit both. So that is Hortensia. And again, if you look at the description and click the show more, you will see all the elements that we have available in that collection. And you can go take a look at them uh, page by page on our site. The next Stamperia collection pack that's coming out is called Princess. And it's very pretty. It's very Baroque and rich looking. Um, what I'm gonna show you today is just a couple of the elements. Um, and then um, there's also going to be an adhesive chipboard available on this collection in late July. They didn't release everything at the same time, so. Here is our princess. Oh, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? <laughs> I haven't seen these yet, so <laughs> we're looking at it at the same time. Beautiful pieces that you could fussy cut for borders or trim out for border pieces. Look at that. Oh, I can totally see how to make beautiful cards with these or um, to even feature these door sets in a mini album. Opportunities to uh, fussy cut down here. This reminds me a little bit of... Um, the hotel collection. It's beautiful. I love this pattern. That's really traditional looking. I love it. And there it is again. Lots of fussy cutting opportunities. If you're not a big fan of um, having images of people in your collection, you can fussy cut this out and use the frame as a frame in your album. And you can do that actually on all of these. Again, this kind of reminds me of Grand Hotel a little bit. The stripes. This is beautiful. Oh, look at all these things you can fussy cut and use as tags. I think I'd want to feature that someplace on the front of the um, album. It's just gorgeous. Lovely, lovely. And some fans here. More opportunities to fussy cut and create tags. And of course, these are card toppers and you could easily cut these out. These are pretty. And more cut aparts. Okay, again, this is a 10 sheet and it's double-sided. We also have the die cuts available. And this is new this year. Um, these are wooden, colored wooden shapes. And so they're kind of on this, kind of like balsa wood, they're laser cut. And the color is just really rich on them. So a couple of the collections have come out with this. We're gonna give this a shot and see how these do in our shop. But these are available to ship right now too. In addition to what you see here, we'll also have the eight by eight paper pack. And um, and then I, the adhesive chipboard ships late July. So 
it looks like I listed that twice. So there is, yep, that's it. That's everything for this collection. So the next collection is called Sweetie. And this collection has all kinds of extra bits and stuff. So these are called decorative chips. And this is actually kind of, um, it's not really a chipboard. It's not quite that rigid, but it's about the same width as chipboard. So these are not colored, they're laser cut so that you can um, hit these with like a Copic marker or you can paint them and uh, add them as embellishments. This one is, let's see, this is called Sweetie Ice Cream and this one's called Sweet Memories and that makes for a great title of your book. Right here it says Chocolate, Sweet Dreams and Enjoy the Moment. These are really cute. Here is another one of those wood, um, colored wooden shapes and it goes with this collection. We'll have the chipboard pieces. And then this is, so what I uh, told you about the other two collections, this is what they call the adhesive back chipboard. And the other two collections will have this in July, but this is available to ship right now. And it is, it's about the same thick, if you're, if you're familiar with um, Graphic 45, it's about the same size. These are all uh, die cut, but they already have an adhesive on the back, which is kind of a nice thing. Okay, so it's, Similar in, in uh, width as the um, the chipboard pack too. Uh, not chipboard, they call this, what do they call it? Die cuts. They call this die cuts, but they're actually quite rigid like chipboard. Okay, I'm gonna set those aside and we're gonna look at the paper. This is really sweet. Lots of pretty things. Great for birthday cards um, or birthday albums. Lots of cut aparts over here behind the cover. And I like these double-sided ones. So you've got, you know, something on both sides. You don't have to mount it on paper if you don't want to. I often do just because I like it to be a little bit more rigid, but they're pretty on both sides. You can easily stick photos in those little squares. This is very pretty, very girly. Okay, beautiful paper. Lovely colors, opportunities to fussy cut. These are card toppers and they're really cute. And again, these make for great, I think, birthday cards. Or tea, tea invitations, tea parties, fussy cutting opportunities, more of that here. This is very cute. Very cute. Isn't that lovely? You could do some interesting things with this where you could cut it into slices and and maybe have um, those slices open up to reveal something. Lovely. And then a whole page of cut aparts, which also happens to be the reverse side of the back, which, you know, you need something on this side so you can use it. So that is Sweetie. Okay, so everything um, for this collection, or this set of collection, it also has an eight by eight. Uh, is available to ship now. And then our the last collection I want to show you is it's actually kind of an old collection, but they've revamped it a little bit. I just want to let you know that the die cuts are back in stock for Alice. That's not new, but they're back in stock. But these wooden um, colored wooden shapes are new. And uh, we have these in our shop and they are available. I'm double checking my notes here. They're available and shipping right now and they're really pretty. Um, and these will make for great embellishments. It's actually quite, they're rigid, but it's quite light. So you don't have to worry about too much weight. Here's that um, adhesive back chipboard that I had mentioned in the previous ones. And what's different about this Alice release is it's got this uh, gold foil throughout it. So that's new for this Alice release. And you're gonna see it on the adhesive chipboard and also in the 12 by 12 22 page release. Now I want to point something out right here. It says 22 double faced sheets, but really it's 22 single faced sheets. So that's kind of a mistake. And we point that out um, on the page in our shop as well, but I want to let you know this is all single sided. So the great news is you don't have to make a choice per sheet. Um, and that's, and you've got this wonderful foil on the cover, it's beautiful. Okay, so again, these are single-sided sheets. And this is a 12 by 12, and there's where you see the gold foil laid in. It's gorgeous. I'm not sure how if it's coming across 
in the video, but it's really quite pretty. It's very detailed. And there's some more. Okay. And then you've got this tag cut apart. So nice, you don't have to make a choice which one you're gonna use. You, you can use every single sheet and not have to choose the one you like the most. More of that gold foil laid in. And again, that's what's unique about this release. It's single-sided, 22 sheets, and it has the gold foil in it. And you will see, as the description, it's Alice Gold, and that's how you'll know. So the Alice Gold is available in the 22 single-sided 12 by 12s and also in that adhesive chipboard. The other Alice items are the, the uh, Alice items that were released a year ago. But everything's back in stock now if you're working on an Alice album. Just beautiful. More cut aparts. And then that's the back cover there. So it's, it's really a beautiful collection. I think the gold accent is just gorgeous. Again, these are all available in our shop. And this is what we're calling the Stamperia Mid-Year Release. And I'll be back in not too long. And what I'm gonna do is a winter collection release. So not everybody is releasing uh, Christmas patterns this year, but there are gonna be some winter collections. And so I'm gonna bundle those all together and do a reveal for those in the coming weeks. We're waiting for some of our orders to come in so we have the product to demonstrate for you. So I wanna thank everybody for taking the time to walk through these new products with us. And I encourage you to go to the description, click the show more and head on over to our shop and take a look at these in detail. Um, like I said, most of this is available and shipping now. A couple of the collections were waiting on the adhesive back um, chipboard. Um, which will be in at the end of July. So be sure to take time to read the um, the note on the pre-orders. If you do pre-order something with other products that are available in stock, we hold everything until all your items are available to ship so that we can ship it all in one um, box. So be sure to, to look at that as you're, as you're placing your order. If you really want to separate and get your the stuff that's available right away, then you're gonna to need to do a separate order. And unfortunately that will trigger an additional shipping expense. So to save on shipping, we hold everything and ship it out to you at once. Otherwise you'll need to do two orders. So thanks everybody for coming over to Scrap and Create to take a look at all these new collections. And I am very anxious to get started um, on some of these new papers and getting some projects out there for you guys to help inspire you for your projects. Come see us at Scrap and Create. This is Daphne. Have a great day.